Assalamualaikum and good morning to all of my students and whoever is watching this video right now. Uh, it's a lovely day and I'm really, really, really enjoying because it's so beautiful outside. There are clouds, it's rain, it's a little rain, drizzling sometimes, sometimes it's raining. So it's beautiful, beautiful weather. So when it, the weather is like that, you are like automatically, you're very happy, your mood is good, and uh, yeah, you like to eat um, uh, like uh, uh, delicious something, something uh, yummy, something a little spicy, which you can enjoy in this weather. So I hope you're all doing that. Mm, so, and right now, uh, we are in our uh, literacy class. So I think in such a good weather, we should also do a little of uh, learning as well. That will be even better because the mood is good and we are enjoying quality. So when we are enjoying and learning, that will be very nice. And we will retain the things. When it's learning and enjoying, learning by doing, uh, we always enjoy, right? And we retain that. So it's always good uh, that when you are in your very good mood, you uh, uh, you are like uh, you know, learning something at that time, uh, you are enjoying a lot and you feel good about yourself. So we want you to feel good about yourself. Uh, we are in our literacy class and we have done alphabets, a lot and lot and lot of alphabets. So uh, I think uh, we should uh, practice a little more with that because I know you all enjoy that. Uh, you all uh, really, really have done well uh, by tracing uh, all the alphabets. So that was really, really nice. So we are going to do the same today, okay? Uh, we will be doing uh, the same um, as we've done uh, before, but that will be a little, little different um, because uh, if it's a different activity, you always enjoy that, I know. So we are going to, uh, yes, we will be tracing uh, the alphabets, but that will be a little, a little different activity, which we'll be doing today. So uh, we are going to start it. And um, for that, you need to take out your book uh yes this one so you need to take out your book a to m alphabet fun a to m yeah this we have done long before uh, because we are doing now the activities on the uh, other textbooks but that's okay so we, you need to take that out right because you have to practice that so you need to take that out um and you should open up page number 58 yes all of you take out page number 58 uh, for that uh, first of all uh, you need to take out the book uh, you will be needing the pencil for sure right uh, but along with that you will be needing your color pencils as well right so uh, before you open up your book you take out your lead pencil with which you will write and take out your color pencils yeah, not the markers, uh, not even the crowns, the color pencils, yes. All of you take out your color pencils, so uh, you because you'll be needing them. Yes. Your lead pencil for writing, your color pencils for coloring, and your yellow A to M alphabet, right? Okay, so you all are on that. Okay. Your light pencil is in your hand, your color pencil is on the table, your book is on the table, that's great. So you do take out page number 58 and put the book flat on the table. Yes, put the book flat on the table. That's great, that's great. Okay, now here is this picture, this page which you can see right now. Right, page number 58, you can see a couple of pictures over here, right? And there are a couple of columns over here, right? So I am going to now tell you that we are going to do what is the activity like, okay? Now this says that they have given you a couple of pictures, okay, right? What is this? Apple, boat, yes, cup. This is a cute friend, yeah, dino, yeah, a so dinosaur, then engine yes flower that's great so you can recognize all the pictures that's really nice okay now they say that name the picture which you have done right now and 
the correct letter. Yes. Now, by looking at the picture, we can name the picture so we know that this word starts with which alphabet, right? So this is apple. Yes, apple. Now, do you all know that apple starts with? That's great. Apple starts with A. That's great. Now, boat starts with B. Boat. B. B. That's great. Then cup. Cup. Cup starts with C. C. That's lovely. D. 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 Dino. Dino, dino, d, d, dino, d, yes, then, engine, engine, e, egg, engine, right, f, f, flower, f, f, yes, that's great, so a, b, c, d, e, f, okay, so these are the initial letters that start, the, this, the word starts right, right, now they have given us a couple of alphabets over here just in front of the uh, just in front of every picture over here right now the next column says color the number one column says the picture we took the name of the picture and we know the initial alphabet of the picture and this says that color now here you're going to look for the alphabet right so and we are going to color the, the alphabet that starts with this picture, right? So for that, you need your color pencils, okay? You can use any color you want to, but don't uh, uh, press it hard. Uh, why? Because like the alphabet won't be able to like clear that, right? It will not be clear. So here you're going to color which circle? The circle which says, hey, that's great, right? So you can make it red, you can make it even green, that's up to you, right? But you're going to color A, right? So you're going to do that later. First, we are going to uh, discuss that, all this color, and then you'll open up your color pencil box, okay? Now here, you're going to color B. Over here, you're going to color C, D, E, and F. That is lovely, okay. Now, you're going to take out your color pencils. I'll give you a minute, and you are going to color all the circles, okay? You're going to stay in the circle. You're not going to go out of the circle because there are other alphabets as well, right? So if you're coloring the circle A, only color that so that would be obvious that you have only colored the A alphabet, right? Okay, now start coloring. Yes, that's great. Now look at your book. Put the book. Put the book flat. Hold the color pencil nicely and properly. Yeah, you know that. You hold it in two fingers like this, and then you lock it with your thumb. Yes. Okay. That's lovely. So only do the circle with the required alphabet. Don't go out of the circle because then that will show that you have colored the other alphabet as well, okay? Okay, so that was easy. Have you done that? Okay, take a couple of seconds more. Okay, that's great. Now show me all of you this color. Have you done that? Okay, that's great. That is great, okay. Okay, now you're going to put your color pencils aside and you need your lead pencil yes okay right that's great yes put them aside very nice okay now you're going to hold your lead pencil in your hand and we are going to now trace okay now you know the shape of the uh, alphabet you know the alphabet you know how to trace it okay now you need to start from here see we were following the red dot and the arrows there are no arrows but they have only given the red dot which you're going to start with right so here you're going to start with sorry here you're going to start with and you know where you're going to start right okay right yes now write a then tra trace a then trace b c d e and f yes all of you start 
Tracy. A, B, C, D, E, and F. Okay. Good, good, good. Yes. Do it slowly. Stay on the dots. Don't go off the line. Because you've practiced it a lot now. Yes, I know you can do it. That's great. You've done it? Okay, that's lovely. Okay. Now we have two columns left which which are empty, right? These two columns. Now these two columns are giving us opportunity to write the alphabet which we have just traced, right? So we are going to write it as the same. We have traced it over here. We have to write A, then A, B, B, C, C, D, D, then E, E, F, and F. Right? Now you have traced it and you know that how you're going to write it over here. Not the small one, not the big one, the same size you're going to write over here. Right? I'm also going to write it and you are also going to write it. Right? And then we will match the uh, alphabet which we have traced and the one which we have just written. Okay? So we'll start writing. That's great. Right? Okay. That's lovely. Write A two times. Yes. Okay. Write A two times. I'm also going to write two times. Okay. My line went a little curvy. Okay, I'll show you that. I'm going to, I'm not going to erase you. Okay, see, I have written A over here and then A in this come this becomes a little curvy, but that's I should make it straight, right? Now you're going to write A and A, right? Like this. Not very big, not very small, uh, the same size which we have just traced. Okay. Now you are going to complete the rest of them, right? Complete up till F. That's great, yes. You've done that? Okay, yes. Yes, 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 do it. You just need to trace, okay? Okay, that's great. Okay, that's lovely. Now I uh, come up on page number 69. Uh, page number 66. First of all, we're going to do page number 66. Yes. Page number 66 is like this. Right? This goes up to M. This is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, right? So you're going to do this as well. This you can do as your homework. You're going to trace A and write A, trace B, then write, then C, then write, then D, okay? So this you should do uh, for your homework. So page number 66, you'll be doing as your homework. And that will give you uh, more practice uh, so your uh, uh, muscles are ready for writing in the notebook as well. Okay, so this was our uh, literacy class in which we have done the tracing of alphabets today. So I'm going to say goodbye from this class and I'll see you in the next class inshallah very soon. Till then, stay safe, be happy and be grateful for whatever we have. Till we see you. Each other soon, inshallah. I'm going to say bye bye and Allah is.